Hi all, welcome to Salesforce in 5 minutes. In this video, we are going to understand how to use lightning data table to bring the related records in LWC. But before getting started, if you like my videos, please subscribe to this channel. So in this video, we are going to specifically focus on how to bring the columns of inside uh, of any object inside the lightning data table we are not going to bring the records so if you already know how to bring the columns you can skip this video so what i'm going to do is i have this account uh, record page i'm going to show all the related contacts inside the lightning data table but in this video i'm just going to add the uh, uh, columns so i'm going to show the name phone number and email of the contact inside my lightning data table so i've already created a created a uh, LWC component named as lightning data table learn and then uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to embed that lightning data table learn over here so first let's create our lightning data table lightning out of this all of this lightning data table right now we just need this three things one of them uh, is nothing but the key field uh, another one is nothing but the columns and third one is nothing but the data so first in this video we are just going to focus on what does this column does ex exactly how why do we use this column field in the next video we will also look into how this data works so let's uh, so basically the column is used to add the columns to their data table okay so inside your data table if you want to add the uh, different types of the column like name of the field phone number and everything like that you can use columns so uh, to show it practically what i'm going to do is i'm going to create a variable let's name it as const columns i'm going to create a columns variable equals to square braces and then i'm going to assign whatever uh, column uh, whatever values inside or whatever fields inside the columns that i have to show for an example first one is label colon i want to show the contact name and then comma field name which field of contact do i want to show first i want to show the name next again i'm just going to copy paste it I have to show the three fields right one of them is name another one is phone number and another one is email so contact phone number the api name of the contact phone number is phone just phone next is contact email the api name of this variable is just email right so we have derived whatever columns of this contact we need to show now the variable that is used to, to show the columns is column list so i'm going to assign the value of these columns to this column list so column list equals to columns so what's happening is whatever the columns are are getting assigned to this variable and using this columns attribute that is defined inside the latin data table the columns will be visible to us i'm going to refresh this page and i should be able to see the columns named as contact name phone and email at the right side okay i did not add the okay, i need to add this okay fine i need to add the lightning record page uh, component to the light uh, to the record uh, to this page as well so the name of our component is lightning data table learn i'm going to drag it and drop it over here that's it our lightning data table is added let's save it and let's view it now the label spelling is incorrect Let's again refresh it. To hard refresh. So as you can see. Our columns are added contact name that is the name of our contact contact phone number that is the name of the uh, phone number of the contact and email contact phone email that is a email of our contact that has been derived from this variable 
we have assigned it to this column list variable which represents the column that defines inside the lightning data table so this is how you add columns in lightning data table in the next video we are going to learn how to add the data to the lightning data table but if you have learned how to add these columns in uh, lightning data table through my video please subscribe to this channel